Hello everyone. In this module, we will discuss about OpenForm software. OpenForm for open source field operation and manipulation is an open source computational fluid dynamics sol released and developed primarily by OpenCFD Limited since 2004. It has a large user base across most areas of engineering and science from both commercial and academic organizations. OpenForm has an extensive range of features to solve anything from complex fluid flows involving chemical reactions, turbulence and heat transfer to acoustics, solid mechanics and electromagnetics. Different variants of OpenForm there are basically two variants of open form first one is open cfd limited version which can be accessed through www.openform.com we will see later in the successive modules which new version released twice a year that is june and december versions are named as version yy mm example version 1912 Website will be remain the same that is https www.openform.com. Similarly, there is another version which is termed as OpenForm Foundation version, which you can access through www.openform.org. No defined date for new releases, and also versions are named with the two digits like 4.1, 2.1, 1.2, etc. Its website is remain same that is https openform.org also one can read the history if interested related to the open form through the uh, following link which can be accessed through www.openform.com news and history now the question is which version to use it depends on the features you want to use just a second, I will just run this previous one. Yes. Okay. It depends on the features you want to use. We can access the website and also check for the release notes to see which one fits better to our framework. If both include the features you need, do some X performance and accuracy. Benchmarks to see which one is better. Otherwise, it is just matter of taste. We will be using the OpenCFD limited version with V some XX for the training purpose. Now we have the open form executables. Unlike many of the software, open form does not have a unique executable. Once compiled, a large number of executables is generated. And they fall into two categories. First one is solver category. Second one is utility category. First solver is defined or designed to de solve a specific continuum mechanics problem. And last is utility that is designed to perform tasks that involve data manipulation. For every solver, Mesh generation etc. There is a separate executable. You should run the right executable according to the solver you are using. Check the documentation to see recommended solvers for different cases. I am giving you some example like simple form. If you simple algorithm, ICO form, if you use Piezo algorithm for laminar flow. Now comes the open form versus commercial software. Being an open source software, the advantages of open form is quite obvious. First one is free to use. Second, a strong focus on customization and flexibility. Full control over the simulation. All these nice features come with a price very deep learning curve. For example, contrary to the commercial safety softwares, there are no default values in open form. 
it is up to the user to set those values which means the user has to know what he or she is doing so as you can see in front of your screen there is a pattern generated through open form which can be described in two layers first layer is having a blue uh, phenomena and the second one is having the red phenomena so how to explain uh, those cases in open form that we will see in the subsequent modules so now comes the point that what are the important features related to open form that we will discuss so open form is basically open source software which provides various advantages over other cfd softwares so open form is basically used for simulating the behavior of fluids gases heat turbulence and chemical reactions in a wide range of engineering and physics domain it is developed in c++ basically c++ programming language and built on top of a flexible object oriented framework making it extensible and customizable for both research and industrial applications so we can do uh, fluid analysis heat transfer analysis chemical reaction analysis turbulence analysis solid mechanics analysis and much more its key features include finite volume method solves partial differential equations using the fvm approach it is customizable fully open source and written in c++ allowing users to develop and modify solvers it's having the wide range of applications from aerodynamics hydrodynamics and combustion to multiphase flow and electromagnetics parallel computing effect or support efficient for high performance computing using mpi pre processing like tools like block mesh snappy hex mesh and visualizes results in para view we can take various advantages of uh, open form in different aspects as you have already seen what type of uh, open form simulation can be done so we can do incompressible flow compressible flow analysis multiphase flow turbulence modeling structural mechanic analysis electromagnetics and open form is a modular software which means users can combine existing components or write their own solvers and models users can create custom boundary conditions material models for entire simulation framework so this much is for introduction to open form